Hello, I'm Colin, and these are the week's top headlines from Pink 60. The executive director of UN AIDS said this week the end of AIDS is in sight. Michelle Sidibe said, I call upon leaders, communities, parents, people living with HIV and young people to look forward and work towards a world with zero new HIV infections. Pharmaceutical company Gilead released its second daily single tablet HIV treatment this week. Evipla is available across 27 EU countries after being granted permission by the European Commission. Just as the world is reporting the lowest ever rates of new HIV transmission, the UK is reporting the highest amongst gay men. One in 20 are now living with HIV, although a quarter of those are unaware of their status. Estonia is attempting to become the first ex-Soviet nation to recognise same-sex unions. The Reform Party and the opposition Social Democrats support the move, but the Conservative government opposes it. And finally, gay X Factor contestant Marcus Collins has secured a place in the British semi-finals. The singer, who recently reported a homophobic hate call, succeeded in the latest rounds with Song Kai Wham and Stevie Wonder. That's all from us today. Join us again tomorrow.